There have been several male actors and female actresses who have reportedly suffered horror or psychological distress after shooting horror movies. Here are a few examples. Linda Blair in The Exorcist, 1973. Linda Blair played the role of Regan McNeil, a possessed young girl in The Exorcist. After filming the movie, she reportedly received death threats and had to hire bodyguards to protect her. Heather Donahue The Blair Witch Project, 1999. Heather Donahue played one of the lead roles in the found footage horror movie The Blair Witch Project. After the film's release, she received hate mail. Jamie Lee Curtis Halloween, 1978. Jamie Lee Curtis played the iconic role of Laurie Strode in John Carpenter's Halloween. Although the film launched her career, it also had a lasting impact on her. She reportedly suffered from nightmares and anxiety after filming. Janet Lee Psycho, 1960. Janet Lee played the role of Marion Crane in Alfred Hitchcock's Psycho. The infamous shower scene in which she is killed by Norman Bates has become one of the most iconic scenes in horror history. However, Lee reportedly had trouble taking showers after filming. Jobeth Williams Poltergeist, 1982. Jobeth Williams played the role of Diane Freeling in Poltergeist. The film's curse, which included several cast members dying after filming, reportedly had a lasting impact on her. She also claimed the trio skeletons were used during the filming of a swimming pool scene, adding to the movie's creepy reputation. Heath Ledger Ledger played the role of the Joker in The Dark Knight, which is not a horror movie per se, but it does contain elements of horror. Ledger reportedly became so immersed in the role that he had trouble sleeping and would often stay up all night practicing his lines and experimenting with different makeup. Sadly, Ledger passed away before the film was released, adding an extra layer of tragedy to his already unsettling performance. Will Poulter, who also appeared in the film, had nightmares after seeing it. I had the worst night's sleep of my life the night after he said. Terrible, terrible, full on nightmares. The film is utterly disturbing. And it's that kind of disturbing feeling that I think lingers longer than a fright. A fright has a very limited lifespan. This idea that humans are capable of what you see in Midsommar is kind of what's most disturbing about it. Despite reading the script and despite being in it and shooting it, and presumably knowing what to expect. Jack Nicholson in The Shining, 1980, Nicholson played the role of a writer who goes insane while staying at an isolated hotel with his family. Nicholson later reported that playing the character had a profound effect on him, and he found himself struggling with his mental health for a period of time after filming. It's worth noting that while these actors have reported suffering from horror after their respective movies, it's unclear whether their experiences were directly caused by their roles or other factors in their lives.